Hi there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. So on this video, I'm going to teach you how to multi-stream in OBS Studio. And right now, as you can see, I'm currently inside this website where you can download OBS because that's the first thing we need to do. And as you can see, I have Windows, Apple, and Linux available here to download. So that means you can use them in every step of the way. Now, if you successfully installed OBS, it should look like this. Currently, I am using it to stream or record this recording that I'm going to show you guys and post it on the video. Now, next up, once you successfully download OBS, the next download I want you to go through is going to be this website. Now, this is a um, multiplier or a plugin inside OBS. It's going to be called Multiport RCMP Outputs Plugin. Once you're here, I want you to simply click on this button, go to downloads. Now, this is the new landing page. You should see on your end after clicking that option. Now it should be looking like this. I know it's a bit overwhelming because of the chance characters. I just want you to scroll down until you see assets. And you'll see right here it's available for Mac OS, Windows 64, and Linux right here. So just choose the specific OS you're running or device. So on my end, I'm going to choose Windows 64. And it should look like this. Now once you install this one, it will not show apparently or it's not going to be visible because it's going to be a plugin inside OBS, right? Now, the next step you want to do, let me just expand this. Okay. And then once you're here, after successfully installing that plugin, you go to docs, choose multiple output, and this little thing will show up. You can place it over here or in the top section. On my end, I'm going to place it over on the left side. Perfect. Now, as you can see, it has three options, add new target, start all or stop all by the name themselves. This is obviously um, a control panel. So if you add a new target here, I'm going to name this one first Facebook. And then I'm going to need the URL and stream key for Facebook. Now to get that one, of course, I'm going to go to my Facebook live. I'm just go to right now. So this is going to be the Facebook live stream key is going to be this one. I'm going to simply copy this and then go back to OBS, paste this one right there. And with this one, I'm going to need the URL, which is going to be this one. Go back to OBS, paste it right there, and you'll be good to go. Now, there are some options or some instances that it's going to be bugging. So I suggest you click on sync to start with OBS if you want them to be your permanent streaming devices. But if not, I suggest you don't click that one and manually input each of the sources for you. Now simply click on OK. So we have Facebook already. Add it up. Perfect. Now we can add a new target. For this one, I think I want to go with, um, let me just say kick. I'm going to place kick right there. So I'm going to need the URL and stream key for kick now. I'll meet you inside kick. So this is kick.com, this is a streaming URL. So I have arrived here by clicking settings, going to scream key. So I have the streaming URL here, copied perfectly. And then I'm going to go back to OBS. Of course, pasting the URL there with no problem at all. And with this one, I think that is a different one. Oh, no, it's the one, right one. Sorry about that. So I'm going to type and copy with this one. Go to OBS, stream key, and click on OK. So I have kick now. So as you can see, it's already multiple instances or multiple streaming. With this one, this is enough. But I want to take it up a notch and tell you about Twitch. Now for Twitch, it should look like this. This is a primary stream key, like so. Go to OBS, forgot to add a Twitch there. Click on Twitch, paste the stream key. And now you might ask me, what kind of URL are we going to use here? Now, that is a very good question because it is not located here or so whatever. The stream key or URL depends on your location. It's going to be this website. Now, as you can see, they are different or they are differ based on your location. The best one for me is Philippines. This is the nearest one. And the farthest one is Japan. So OBS gives you the top 10 results. I'm going to paste this link on the description below so you won't have a hard time. So I'm just going to copy this one and go back to OBS. 
simply paste on your URL, click on OK. So with that being said, I have this three sources. I can stream all this one, go live, go stream, all at the same time. But I'm not going to do this right now because I'm currently recording, but it's just one click of a button with this one and you could be good to go. Or you can click on start all to start everything all at the same time. You can start individually, of course, you can modify if you want. For example, you want to change the settings of Facebook differ from Kick or Twitch, please do so. That being said, this is how you multi-stream on OBS Studio. So again, thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button and subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Goodbye for now.